Hi. Good morning, my dear students. Welcome back. Now let's revise once again what we have learned in previous class. We have discussed about word. So, students, what is a word? Let's revise once again. A word is a group of letters which can be spoken or written. It has a meaning and it is a small unit of language. I hope now the word is clear to you all now. Student, I want to give you one important information. If you want to note down the exercises, you can do so. Otherwise, all exercises are available in the download section of our school website. Our school website is www.lfsraptinagar.com dot ac dot in once again i repeat www dot lfs raktinagar dot ac dot in all exercises will be available in this website okay you can get all the exercises from here so let's start exercise B. Let's read exercise B now. Can you rearrange the jumbled names of the different sports goods that are being sold at this shop? Give it a try. So children, here we have to rearrange the jumble names of different sports good and write the correct name in the blank. The blank is given, there you have to write the correct name of the sports. Now, the first one. First one is C K O E C U T L T H S. Now this is a jumble word. Now you have to write the correct word in the blank. So what you are going to write? Which word it is? It is shutter cock. Now, fourth one is E V G O L 
S. Now, what is the correct word of E V G O L S? The correct word is gloves. G L O B T S. G L O B E S. Gloves. Now, what is the correct word of A P D S? Correct word of fifth one. A P D S. The correct word is pads. P A D S. Pads. P A D S. Pads. This is the correct word. Now, what is the correct word of the sixth one? S H C E C S O B D R A. What is the correct word of sixth one is? The correct one is chess board. Sixth one is chess board. C H E S S B O A R D. Chess board. Clear children? Fourth one is gloves. G L O V E S. Gloves. Fifth one is pads. P A D S pads. Sixth one is chess board. C H E double S B O A R D. Chess board. It's clear now? Now let's see the seventh one. Seventh one is R A C O R M. Caram. Seventh one is. Carom. The correct word is carom. C A R R O M. Carom. Seventh one is carom. Now, eighth one. Let's see the eighth one. L A L B O F O T. Now, what is the correct word of L A L B O F O T? The correct word is football. Correct word is football. Now, let's write football. F O O T A B A D A L L. Football. F O O T B A D A L L. Football. Now, which is the and now, what is ninth one? Let's read the ninth one. V L O L A L B Y L E. Now the correct word is volleyball. What is the correct word? Correct word is volleyball. Now let's write volleyball. V O L L E Y B A L L volleyball. So ninth one is volleyball. Now last one, tenth one. So let me repeat once again. Seventh one, carom. C A R R O M carom. Eighth one, football. F double O T B A double L. Football. Ninth one is volleyball. V O double L E Y B A double L. Volleyball. Now let's see the last one. Last one is O H K Y C E C S K I T. So, what is the correct word of the tenth one? The correct word is hockey stick. Hockey. Hockey. Stick. The correct one is hockey stick. Okay, children. So, here you have. Now, in this exercise, you have written all the 
words correct words okay now let, let's repeat once again first one is shuttlecock s h u double t l e c o c k shuttlecock second one is bat b a t bat third one is racket r a c q u e t racket fourth one is gloves g l o v e s gloves fifth one is pads p a d s pads sixth one is chess board c h e w s b o a r d chess board seventh one is carrom c a double r o m carrom eighth one is football f w o t foot b a w l ball football Ninth one is volleyball, V O double L E Y B A L L volleyball. Now the last one is hockey stick, H O C K E Y S T I C K hockey stick. I hope this exercise is clear to you all now. Now let's move on to the C one exercise C. Now let's read what is given in exercise C. Now, in exercise C, I am going to show you the picture and I, then I am going to explain and write the word. Now, in exercise C, can you see the picture? Okay. In the first one, the first picture is butter and the second picture is milk. When you combine both the words, which word will form butter, milk? Yes? Butter, milk. In second one, first picture is cup. And the second picture is board. What, when you will combine both the words, which new word will form? It is cup, bird. It is cup, bird. Okay. Now let's see the third one. In third one, the first picture is foot and the second picture is of ball when you combine both the words which new word will form it will be football now in fourth one the first picture is of honey and the second picture is of bee when you combine both the words which new word will form that is honey B. That is honey B. In fifth picture, the first one is house and the second one is boat. When you combine both the words, the new word will be house boat. House boat. In the sixth one, the first picture is of light. And second picture is of house. When you combine both the words, the new word will be light house. The new word will be light house. In seventh one, the first picture is of, of P. And the second picture is of cock. And when you combine both the words, the new words will the new word will be peacock. The new word will be peacock. Now eighth one. The first picture is of rain, and the second picture is of bow. When you combine both the words, the new word will be rainbow. The new word will be rainbow. Now, in 9, 1, the first picture is of star and the second picture is of fish. When you combine both the words, 
The new word will be starfish. The new word will be starfish. In tenth one, the first picture is of sun. And the second picture is of flower. The new word will be sun flower. The new word will be sun flower. So, let's repeat. First one is butter milk. Butter milk. Second one is cup bird. Cup bird. Third one is foot ball. Foot ball. Fourth one is honey bee. Honey bee. Fifth one is house boat. House boat. Sixth one is Light house. Light house. Seventh one is peacock. Peacock. Eighth one is rainbow. Rainbow. Ninth one is starfish. Starfish. Tenth one is sunflower. Sun flower. Now let me write these words on the boat. First one is butter milk. Butter milk. Second one is cup bird. Cup bird. Third one is football. Fourth one is honey bee. Honey bee. Fifth one is house boat. House boat. Sixth one is light house. House. Seventh one is peacock. Peacock. Eighth one is rainbow. Rainbow. Okay, children? Ninth one is starfish. Starfish. Tenth one is sun flower. Tenth one is sun flower. I hope this exercise is clear to you all now. Now let's move on to exercise D. Exercise D. Now, in exercise D, it is a matching compound words. Exercise D is a matching compound words. 
Here what you have to do, you have to the, draw the lines to match each of the words on the left with the word on the right. Okay children? But instead of drawing lines, let's write answer beside the question. Okay student, I will show you on the board how to write the answer beside the question. You don't have to worry, I am going to show you on the board. Okay. So, you don't have to draw the lines, just write the answer beside the question. Let's see. Now, D1. First is basket. Yes? So, what is the Correct word? The correct word is ball. What is the correct word? Correct word is ball. Next is ground. Now. Now, what is the correct word here? What are you going to write with ground? Ground, nut. Ground, nut. Okay, children? Now the third one. Third one is moon. Third one is moon. Now, what you are going to write with moon? You have right. The correct word is light. L I G H T. Moon light. First one is basket wall. Second one is crown, nut. Third one is moon, light. Okay children? Now let's see the fourth one. Fourth one is sun, shine. Shine. What is the correct word? Shine. Fifth one is butter, fly. Okay, children. Fifth one is butter, fly. The correct word is butter, fly. Now, the sixth one is wrist. Watch. Wrist watch. The correct word is watch. Wrist watch. Sixth one is wrist to watch. Now let's see once again. Sun shine. Sun shine. Fifth one butter fly. Butter fly. Sixth one is wrist watch. Wrist watch. Now let's see the seventh one. Seventh one is tea spoon. Tea spoon. Seventh one is tea spoon. The correct word correct word is spoon. Eighth one. Eighth one is tool brush. Tool brush. The correct word is Brush. Ninth one. Ninth one is dough. Mat. Dough. Mat. Ninth one is dough. Mat. The last one is window. Pain. Window. Pain. The correct word is pain. So let's see once again. Seventh one is tea spoon. Tea spoon. Eighth one is tooth brush. Tooth brush. Ninth one is dough mat. 
do mat and tenth one is window pane window pane now let me revise once again basket ball basket ball second one ground nut ground nut third one moon light moon light fourth one sun shine sun shine fifth one butter fly butter fly sixth one wrist watch wrist watch seventh one tea spoon tea spoon eighth one tooth brush tooth brush ninth one do mat do mat and the last one is window pane window pane i hope all these exercises are clear to you all now let's move on to the next now your in exercise e word chain is given read the series of words below the last two letters of the first word are the first two of the next like orange okay which is the last two letters g e and the second one g is the first two letters then in genius last two letter is u s and use u s is the first two letters okay now make your own word chain starting with the word grammar now in grammar which is the last two letters last two letters is a r so what you are going to write a r if the a r is the first two letters which letters will come in the blank okay so which letters are going to come in the blank it is the first two letters are a r then what will come in these three which letters are going to come in these three blanks it is r o w okay so which word is this arrow a r r o w arrow now in arrow last two letters is last two letters are o w now now you have to make your own word with o w so let's make new word with o w it is o w n e r o n a o n a okay when o w is the first two letters so you have to make a new word with four first two letters o w n e r o n a now with e r you have to make a new word okay so what which word you are going to make try children let's try e with e r e r e r r o r error okay so this is the new word you are going to make with e r e r r o r error error okay so this is exercise e now in exercise f children see the following pictures then form sentences using giving words given words now here can you see the picture first picture and can you see the words here and in the second picture it's very easy to it's very easy exercise i think uh, you can do at home by own so it is a homework for you all now this lesson is over we'll start new lesson in next class lesson 2 we'll start in the next class thank you and have a nice day